Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, Carolyn Al Prisms. I am a stamping up demonstrator from Canada, and today we are making a Remembrance Day card. So we're starting off with real red, basic black, some white cardstock, and I have a few a mixed bag of a whole bunch of different things we're going to use. So the dies today we're using are Delicate Lace, which I'm using this piece, and we're using Poppy Moments dies, which are all these right here, and some leaves, and they will be in the black. And this white piece will be our background piece, and I'll be doing some, some of my own stamping to give it a nice textured look. All right, so we're using Avent Garden as one of the stamps. I'll be using some flowers here and some of the leaves. And then we're using Peaceful Moments and I'm going to use Always Remember. All right, so my base card stock is the real red and this is nine by seven and a half and scored at three and a quarter. This is called a slim line card. Okay, so I'm gonna fold this right now and we'll get going. I'll finish it. Now let's get stamping right away. Okay, so I'm going to start with the largest of my stamps and then I'll fill in with the smaller pieces, the smaller images. I'm using Memento Black. Let me. Hmm. thinking about that poor dog. I have this all stamped out. I'm going to just put it aside for now because now I want to do some cutting out of my poppies. And these are just pieces of real red here I'm going to use and some basic black. All right. So I'm going to cut out some poppies and some leaves and I will be right back. All right, so I've got all my pieces cut out. I have my poppies that I'm gonna to put together. I'm gonna to glue that. And I've got a small one that I'll glue. My leaves are all in black. And this little piece will go on, if I can pick them up, on here. And these two pieces are gonna go, one will go here or I might put them here, and the other one will go on the back like this. And then I'll arrange, glue my flowers together, and I'll arrange everything, the leaves and the flowers, after I glue this onto the base. It's all glued on. I've got my poppies all ready to go. I glued the top to the bottom and the little middle piece. Now I'm just gonna figure out how I want this on my card. You just gotta play with these sometimes. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll get this glued on. Okay, so before I glue all my poppies on and my leaves, I'm going to stamp my Always Remember first. Then I will, there we go. I'm going to take my ornate dies and I'm going to take, okay, I'm taking this one and I'm going to run this through my big shot. Okay, so I cut out my always remember and I took a piece of black cardstock and I just flagged the ends. So now I will glue my piece on. 
So I've got my always remembered glued, uh, actually he's on dimensionals, and my poppy's glued in. I've got a few leaves glued in, and I am gonna put my little poppy on dimensionals, but let me glue this guy in first. There we go. Okay. And let me get him in. Almost done. this and then we'll get one more set of leaves on there we go so our remembrance day card is now finished and i'm really happy with the way it turned out i love the colors and i love that we're we are remembering thank you so much for watching uh Please press like if you really enjoyed the video and subscribe. We put out videos every Friday. So please come and visit us again. Bye for now and have a great day. So I decided I'm going to put a little bit of Wink of Stella on just the edge of my big poppy. Just to give it a bit of a bit of a bling. And Wink is stellar. It's really, really, really fun to play with. It's a nice kind of a silvery little, I don't know if you can see that. It's got a nice little sparkle to it. I'm all full of ink, but I think you can see it. It's got a nice sparkle. I don't know. But it's nice. I like to use it. Okay. I think we're now done.